Alrighty, well, here's an interesting repair job. The freezer. But it's kind of soaked with water. So essentially, as it freezes, it's blowing off the insulation at the back of this thing. So originally I was throwing a, uh, a hair dryer on it to try and dry it out. But the water is like so far into this foam that I'm basically trying to tear it back before doing some sick boom to refill it. So, don't know if it'll be successful, but that's the plan. We're now at 45 degrees in the sun and the back of this fridge has had a lot of time out here to try and dry out and we're not getting any moisture coming out when we compress on the foam now. So I think we're at the best possible chance to re-insulate and get this sealed up and hopefully back to cooling our beer. There's some existing cavities possibly part of the manufacturing process and what I've made up over here I've got a bit of plastic as a release liner and a bit of MDF it's basically going to sit in over the back be screwed in I'm going to pop a few holes in it and use high yield expanding foam and uh, insert some foam in there. The board will hopefully keep it fairly flat with some relief holes so it's got somewhere for the pressure to go. And we'll see if we can do a job of this. So I've just positioned the plastic in between. Now when I press up on that, making sure that it's held in place, I've marked where I'm going to insert, and I'll just screw the back on. Okay, so we've now got it screwed in. I'm just going to drill my access holes and right, spray my holes are drilled. Now, we're going for sicker bomb. Read the manual, eh? Hey? Alright. That's looking like a full thing. And now we just let it do its bit. It'll keep expanding. Quite a bit I'm imagining. But that should fill out all the gaps and should end up with a nice foam. Alright, and now we wait. Gloop, 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 gloop. Gloop, 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 gloop. Lovely. Pretty well with that sheet of black plastic. 
got a lot more noise happening, so it's probably going to queue up a little bit more for the rest of the day. That's quite flat. So curiously, this has actually shrunk back. As it freezes up, we've got some heat in the condenser. We just have to hope that there's enough protection over the freezer and enough waterproof nature so that we don't have any vapor coming in and freezing up. But we'll see you.